I would like to present two MLGW Community Hero Awards today. The Memphis Light Gas and Water Hero Award is a new honor created to recognize citizens in the MLGW service area who have gone beyond, above and beyond in efforts to assist and serve MLGW customers. Today, our first Community Hero Award goes to Pastor Keith Norman. I have been working for MLGW for four years now. And many nights during these four years, I received a text, an email, a phone call from Pastor Norman. <coughs> and usually it's after he has seen a story on the news about one of our customers who's having hardships and their services have been caught, cut off. And all he says is, Gail, I got that. Send me the customer's information tomorrow. He doesn't ask if the person is a member of his church. He doesn't ask if they go to church. He don't care what color they are, their income, or whatever. He just helps. A lot of times it comes out of Pastor Norman's pocket. He goes above and beyond. So Pastor Norman, we wanted to publicly recognize you and thank you for what you do for our community and for our customers. Wow. Community service is the debt that you pay for the blessings that God gives you and for living on his great earth. And so every day I try to find someone that I can give God's resources or blessings to because they're not ours to keep. We're supposed to just let them flow. And that award is going to Grizzlies player, Zach Randolph. Zach's community spirit has been evident in his work with St. Jude Children's Medical Center, Boys and Girls Club of Greater Memphis, the Salvation Army, and MIFA's Holiday Hope Chest. Today, we celebrate Zach's contributions beyond the game. Last year, as the Memphis area suffered through an unseasonably cold January, Zach contacted MLGW with a desire to help those who, was, who were affected. The result was many families getting utilities restored when they needed it most. This year, for the second consecutive year, Randolph paid the utility bills for more than 100 families in need to help them during these tough economic times. Because, you know, I was come from a single parent, uh, single, um, single, you know, family home, uh, you know, one mother, uh, no father. So, you know, I, <clears throat> I know about tough times. So it was just something God, you know, has put on my heart and has blessed me to be in a position that I am just to give back. So thank you. <laughs> 